Hey guys, how's it going? Um, so I'm here at Santa Ana River Trail, actually Green River Golf Course. Uh, just, I'm not gonna lie, the sketchy, uh, the parking lot is a little sketchy. So hopefully uh, the empty golf course doesn't mind me using their parking lot. But from here, it's about a 0.3 mile bike to the beginning of the trail. Uh, so I'm just have to go past the sketchy parking lot, but that's not that bad. I don't just want to leave my car there Because uh, it's pretty open, you know, no doors, no top So that's just personal preference uh, It is also Tuesday morning So maybe like if you come on a weekend, there'll be more cars and more runners, bikers So you don't have to worry about um, Yeah the sketchiness of the homeless dudes that are down by the river. Uh, uh, but yeah, other than that, I'll let you guys know how it is. I got the GoPro, but only about seven minutes of film time. So let me see if I could crunch it in. It's about 13 miles to Angel Stadium and then uh, about 30 miles to the beach. But we'll see what we can do and uh, see what I can squeeze into it. But anyways, I'll catch y'all later. Hope you enjoy. All right, guys. Uh, so I guess I ran into the greenskeeper. He told me I couldn't park here. Uh, got a little upset. I actually made a rant video, but I'm not going to show it anymore because it is what it is. <laughs> uh, kind of pulled a Karen. Pulled a Ken. Uh, the manager, I could tell how he was walk, driving around. Uh, he drove past me. I was like, hey, sir. And I was like, is it okay if I park here? Like, I was told by the greenskeeper I couldn't. And he's like, I told you you couldn't park here? And I'm like, yeah, no, it's just, I don't want to park down there at Green River Road. A lot of homeless, a lot of, it's just, I don't feel as comfortable leaving. He's like, oh, okay. He's like, well, uh, go park over there. And then, so now I'm close to the pro shop. But, uh, yeah, super cool dude. Uh, you gotta be careful, I guess. You know who you talk to. Uh, I even offered to buy something at the pro shop and he said, don't worry about it, just park. He said, uh, be safe, so. Really cool people here, so. Um, yeah, Green River Golf Course. You know, if you guys wanna catch around, they're open. And, uh, yeah, definitely come here. I played a couple rounds here when I play golf, so pretty cool. All right, I'll catch y'all later. See ya. All right, guys, here begins our trail on the parking lot, the sketchy parking lot that I uh, mentioned. There's about four or five cars there around like 5.50. Um, yeah, super sketchy. So if you can utilize that golf course parking lot and, um, uh, you know, just be courteous when you go. Be polite and they shouldn't have a problem with you. So, uh, yeah, here's the beginning of the trail. You have one morning jogger, walker. So, uh, yeah, first uphill climb and then, uh, it's about a quarter mile, and once you get up past the top, it's about a mile coasting into the RV park on the other side. So not too bad. Um, yeah, and then it's it's a scenic route. As far as this part, you're looking to your left. You get to see traffic, especially on a weekday morning like this one. You'll see plenty of it. That is until you get to the RV park. And then uh, this wall really blocks your view. Um, yeah, but as far as this ride, we only get to Angel Stadium. Uh, just because I had work this morning. So it was, uh, I just really crunch it in. You know, I know I said Angel Stadium was 13 miles, but they lied. It's actually 17 miles by this path, which isn't too bad. 
did it about an hour there. So it was about two hours round trip, uh, 33 miles. So uh, you'll be able to fact check me at the end. Be careful of these fork in the roads. Um, you don't want to get lost one wrong turn. And they'll send you a couple miles extra. So I just want to read the signs, make sure it's Santa Ana River Trail. Um, some are sneaky, but most of them can be seen from quite a while. Uh, yeah, not too many people out here. So I made riding smooth. It is also 6.40, 6.50 in the morning. So not too many people up. But on the way back, you'll see a, a lot more cars, a lot more joggers and bikers. And I believe I finished about 8.30 in the morning. So there's plenty of people getting out on these trails at that time. So yeah, just choose your time. There's a lot of constructions on these paths. And then uh, as far as miles four through six, it's a little bit back and forth between the trail and the road. Yeah, so when you're coming down here, just be careful. Uh, you don't want to cross into another path and then run into an oncoming biker. Yeah, just be wary of something like that. And back to seeing nobody for a little bit. And at this point, just at past mile nine, I got lost and didn't know what way to go. I asked a homeless guy um, what way to go. Used a couple of choice words under my breath after because he didn't answer. Yeah. Didn't really care, so it just. Yeah, it's a good tip. Don't uh, don't ask strangers for directions because they don't care. Just uh, read a sign, do a little bit more research on it. Everything's there on the trail for you. It's not meant to make you confused or lost. So. Yeah, just avoid the troubles of asking somebody. And here's the river. Stagnant water of a river. So, not too bad. It was a cloudy morning. It was about 65 degrees out. And uh, here's mile 10. My earbuds die just about here at mile 11. And uh, yeah, I was super excited to see Angel Stadium at mile 13, but mile 17 is where you have to wait. Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, so I'm about dropping my bag, but uh, 17 and a half miles. I already started my journey back to Yorba Linda, uh, but here behind me, yeah, the Honda Center, the home of the ducks, you know, but it's all good out here in Anaheim. Uh, I actually got to the halo, but I think it's pretty ugly, so I don't want to I don't want in my background, I'd rather be looking at the Honda Center. And then, uh, other than that, it's been a good path. Uh, very nice, not too many people. Uh, the GoPro died, and my earbuds died finally, after the first charge back at Zion. So, uh, pretty good lifespan. But, uh, yeah, it's a great trail, great morning. A little, a little cloudy, so not too hot out here. And then, uh, yeah, super, super cool. So, 
Hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, what I've brought to you. And uh, on track for 35 miles. So let's see what happens. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. So stay safe, stay healthy, and uh, have fun.